The Push to TV is an adapter that attaches to your TV and lets you mirror the screen of your Android device. Getting the Push to TV set up and ready to use with Miracast is both easy and fast. All you need to get started is an HDTV, HDMI cable, and Miracast enabled device, such as the Samsung Galaxy S4 or HTC One smartphone. Included with the Push to TV are the wireless display adapter, USB cable, power adapter, and quick start guide. Once you have unboxed your product, simply plug one end of your HDMI cable into the PTV and the other end into your HDTV. Next, plug in the provided USB power cable into the Push to TV. Your wireless display adapter can be powered by using the power adapter provided or by simply plugging in the USB cable into your TV's USB port. Now, turn on your TV and ensure that it is set to the correct input. The Ready for Connection screen will be displayed within a few seconds after powering on your PTV. Although you can connect your device at this time, it is recommended that you update to the newest firmware for the best entertainment experience. In order to update your push to TV, press and hold the button on the side of your device for 7 seconds. Next, follow the steps on your screen or follow along to complete your firmware update. Step 1. Use your PC or mobile device and navigate to support.netgear.com slash product slash PTV3000. Under Downloads, click the newest firmware version. From the new tab that is opened, click Download Now. Before downloading your update, please take time to register your product. Once registration is complete, your firmware will begin downloading automatically. Make sure to have the firmware file saved to a known folder location to make uploading quick and easy. Step 2. Using the Wireless Network Manager utility on your device, search for Push to TV Wireless Network Name SSID and connect. Step 3. Open a web browser on your device and type 192.168. Point three point one into the URL bar to access the settings for your Push to TV. Step 4. Under Firmware Update, click Choose File, and then upload the updated firmware. Please ensure that your firmware file is unzipped and of a .sbin file type before uploading to the PTV. The firmware update can take up to a minute to complete and your device will restart during this process. Once completed, you are now ready to connect your Miracast device. To start mirroring your phone screen on your TV, there are just a few steps to follow. The steps to connect may slightly differ by device. We are going to use the Samsung Galaxy S3 to show how to connect. When using the Samsung Galaxy S3, you can access Miracast a few different ways. The quickest and easiest way is to simply pull down the top menu, swipe over to All Sharecast, and click the button to start the program. Your phone will now scan for the Push to TV adapter and will show all Miracast compatible devices in your area once scanning is complete. Simply select the device you wish to connect to and click connect. Within a few seconds of connecting, your screen will be wirelessly mirrored on your TV. Since all TVs and phones have different aspect ratios, it may be necessary to change how the image is displayed on your TV. To do this, open the settings tab on your TV, go to your picture settings, and change the aspect ratio so that your device is displayed across the entire screen. Now that you're connected and your screen is displayed on your TV, you're free to enjoy all your favorite content through your phone. For example, you can display your photos upon the big screen and share them with your friends, watch movies from your phone's Netflix app in Full HD, browse through your newsfeed on Facebook, or use a fun app like your karaoke app or your favorite game. Another great way to use your PTV is to video call family and friends and let everyone join in on the fun. There are so many ways to play with your Push to TV and your smartphone. It lets you instantly take advantage of your big screen TV without ever using wires or cables. For more information about the Push 2 TV, please visit www.netgear.com stream.